Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today we're having, we're doing another reading vlog. I'm about to leave to go to work, but I thought I'd just intro this vlog. I started reading The Bodyguard by Catherine Center and I'm only on chapter two, but because I'm gonna work from four to midnight, I'm sure I'll have a lot of time to read during that time. And I'm excited to read that book. The first chapter was quite captivating. I like the way it's written so far. I'm liking our main character. I still don't know her name. I think they mentioned it. I don't remember. Anyways, yeah, I don't really know what this book's about. Like, I kind of know I have a general idea because I've heard two people talk about it before. That's why I've decided to read it. But I don't really know, like, the exact plot line of the book. I think it's going to be... I don't think it's going to be, like, an enemies to lovers. I think it's going to be something to lovers so i'm excited to see how it goes i'm just gonna go to work and i might film a little bit at work if not i will catch up with you guys tomorrow good morning everyone welcome to the next day of the vlog i just got out of the shower that's why i look like this but i thought i'd update you so i haven't read anything today but i did get to 25 percent of the bodyguard yesterday so far i'm really enjoying it this book is pretty fun like the way that it's written and I'm really liking the characters so far. I can't wait to get to know them a little bit better. But yeah, not a whole lot has happened. The main character got broken up with and that made her kind of go into a little bit of a spiral. And she just wanted to leave the country, which is something that usually happens with her job. But because of her boss, she isn't able to. Her boss positioned her in an assignment. It's where she lives in Houston. And it's with like this really famous actor and he doesn't want like his family to know that he hired her or her agency for like security purposes. So they're going to pretend that they're dating. That's his idea. She really doesn't want it. But they're going to pretend that they're dating so that his family doesn't pick up on the fact that she's actually her, it's not really bodyguard. She says it's not a bodyguard, but yeah her bodyguard i'm i'm enjoying it so far i'm just gonna go sit down and read for a little bit right now and i'll update you in a little bit i still have like four hours until i need to go to work today so yeah Good morning, friends. Well, not good morning because it's nighttime, but hey, friends. I haven't spoken to you since, what, yesterday at lunchtime? It's now 8.30 p.m. on Thursday, the 5th of October. I've read a little bit of my book. I read a lot of it yesterday, which I was very happy with. I'm currently at 72%, so I've read 20% of it today. I would like to finish it today. I don't really know if that's going to happen, though. I thought I might tell you what's going on. We're following Hannah and Jack and hannah is a protection officer whatever she's kind of like a bodyguard and jack is this really famous actor who has like his team hired hannah and her company uh well the company she works for to protect jack because he is going to houston to be close to his family and his mom while his mom is undergoing cancer treatment and because jack doesn't want to worry his family with the whole stalker thing he comes up with the idea that hannah should be his fake girlfriend I'm really loving this book because it's basically like reading a rom-com.
the do not have a book well i do kind of have a book update i only have 25 minutes to go 92 percent of the way through but dinner just arrived my mom got mcdonald's i got a diet coke and i also got fries i got a double cheeseburger in the box here closest to my hand that's 10 chicken nuggets we always get 20 and then we split them amongst all of us and they're amazing so i just brought a box and then i'll like eat however many i want and then i also got an apple pie which is in the kitchen i can't wait to have that hello everyone welcome to a new day of the vlog i think this is the third or fourth day Yesterday I didn't really film much because my camera died just as I was about to film But today is Monday and I thought I would like come on and update you on the reading I don't really remember where I left off last I think I might have still been reading The Bodyguard by Catherine Center I finished that, I rated it 5 stars, it was a really good book, really fun It literally just felt as if I was reading a rom-com it made me giddy. It made me giddy. I love the book. The characters were so cute. The romance was adorable. Then I wasn't sure what I wanted to read. I haven't really been in a massive fantasy mood, but I thought I would pick up a fantasy book and I went on Kobo and Kobo has like books for 99 cents all the time. And the one that called, that kind of like drew my attention to it was Strange the Dreamer by Lainey Taylor. So that's what I have now. It was 99 cents. I, if you weren't on booktube in like 2017, 2018, you might not have heard of this book, but this book was massive on booktube. I never really got to reading this book and I thought, you know what, what better opportunity to read this than when it's 99 cents on Kobo. Guys, it's been a little bit as you saw i read a little more of my book i read another chapter and it's currently 10 to 4. i had a really late breakfast this morning i had breakfast at like 11 a.m so i didn't really get hungry until now and i just got myself some mcdonald's uber eats didn't used to deliver to my house because i live in the countryside and the other day i checked and they do so i got myself some mcdonald's and i guess i'll show you what i got so first things first, I got a Diet Coke, obviously. This is a medium. Medium fry, four piece chicken nugget, a Big Mac. I'm going to absolutely devour this right now. I'm so hungry. Okay, so I think the last time I spoke to you, I was having lunch or my food had just arrived. So it's been a little bit. I went to the grocery store and I'm, I've decided to not read more of strange the dreamer i don't think like for right now i feel like it's too hot for me to be reading a fantasy book so i went on kobo and i'm probably gonna go on it again and i just try to find like free romance books i'm not really in the mood to be buying books right now because i'm not sure what exactly i want to read but i bought this one called enemies with benefits by roxy noir and yeah i don't know it just like enemies to lovers which i love and it was free so why not it had a cute cover i like cartoon covers so um i'm probably gonna try to read that one i'm not dnfing stranger dreamer like at all i was actually enjoying it i read two or three chapters of it and i was enjoying it but it's just not the right vibe yet like weather wise and everything and i'm definitely quite a bit of a mood reader
my friends it's been a few days since i spoke to you actually the last time i spoke to you i think it was monday it's now thursday i haven't done a whole lot of reading but um the last time i was here i left off on what's it called enemies with benefits i think that's what it's called i am still reading that book so i left off on monday with you guys and i read a little bit uh on tuesday i didn't read anything yesterday i haven't read anything today yet that being said i'm planning on doing a little bit of reading right now because i have some time before i go make dinner it's also i'm 20 years old yesterday was my birthday this is my first time filming as a 20 year old which is kind of crazy to think about that i'm not a teen anymore but now let's get back to business Hello friends, welcome to yet another day of this reading vlog. Today is in fact going to be the last day. I wanted to just update you guys on my reading. I didn't read a whole lot at work today because I was really busy, but I am now 38% of the way through Enemies with Benefits. I only really got this because it was free on Kobo and I'm not gonna lie, it looks yeah, it feels like it was free on Kobo. It's it's like a fun read, but it's really dragging in some parts. hi guys i just wanted to come on here and end this vlog off right now like really quick thank you so so much for watching um i did not finish friend enemies with benefits that's what it's called but i did get a little bit further along into it so far it's shaping up to be like three stars maybe i don't know we'll see but um you'll probably know more about it in my next video with that being said, again, thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you for being here and just giving me some of your time. That's so nice of you. Now, I will see you next week with a new video. Obviously, don't forget to do all of the good stuff that makes me so happy. Liking my video, subscribing to my channel, and checking out my like social media. It's down below. And I am just loving that the weather is getting cozier it's going to be so nice for more reading vlogs and i hope you guys like that too with all that being said i will see you again next week have a great day a great week a great month i adore you and i'll see you next week bye